I need my medication. <laughs> you all pretend like you don't have any control over me, but you literally, you're the reason that I can't be on medication anymore. You're the reason that I can't have a therapist anymore. And you, <laughs> you don't even really deny it. You'll admit that you contacted my therapist, but then say, well, we have the right to. We have the right to. We're abusers online who have been harassing and stalking you for a year. We have the right to speak to your medical professionals about what we think should happen to you. We're your abusive family. We have the right to tell your therapist to help us abuse you. We have that right. You don't. It's a right you gave yourself. And now I'm not allowed to take my medication. I'm not allowed to get help for my problems. I'm not allowed to have problems. Why? Because Kathy said that it doesn't run in our family. And I've never had any problems before. <laughs> because Kathy said, Kathy denies everything. Kathy created this fucking fictional world where I've never had anything wrong with me and I just created it all because I'm selfish and lazy. And she has these thousands of supporters who are helping her. She literally said, well, her family would accept her back if she would stop pretending to have mental health problems. <laughs> and if pe new people come to look at these videos, then they'll say, well, she clearly needs help. And they'll be told, no, she's acting. This is all just an act, a scam, a grift. No feelings are actually real. No tears are actually real. Nobody's ever actually going to believe anything. They message me every single day telling me that nobody's ever going to believe me. And for a year they have been right. Nobody is ever going to believe me. They're going to continue saying that it's all just a game or a scam or a grift. Because they fully believe that marijuana has side effects this strongly. They fully believe that marijuana has the same side effects as schizophrenia borderline personality, bipolar, and CPTSD. <laughs> and that that's my only problem. If I would just stop smoking weed, I wouldn't have any, any of these breakdowns or any of these problems that I've been dealing with since I was literally a child. <laughs> I was depressed to the point of suicide as a, like before 10 years old. And my family is still just gonna laugh and say she's lying. Just don't ever look at her and believe that her feelings are real. <laughs>